And then when the video came on, I was gonna say, me and Henry apologize for absolutely nothing. <laughs> We're not apologizing for nothing. We Praise Master Jesus. Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. God, God is a good God. Is a good God. God is awesome God, y'all. This is Henry. I am Monique. She is my wife, y'all. <laughs> yeah, he's my husband. <laughs> he's so silly. Yeah. yeah, so I don't know uh, this girl's name. Uh, Naya Riviera. Yes. Yes. Very important that we share this because mm -hmm. God is still saying something. Yes, he is. I'm going to share the vision in a minute. I had a vision about Naya Riviera, but I'm going to share that in a minute. Please watch this video to the fullest. Um, me and my husband, we've been busy. As you know, we've been in Tennessee and we had a lovely time. Tennessee is beautiful, okay? Ooh, my God. Uh, and uh, before we went to Tennessee, though, we did see some crazy comments and uh, even on our Instagram, crazy, disrespectful comments um, towards us. And uh, one lady said she's highly disappointed in us. <laughs> highly disappointed in us. It, it's so crazy, though. It's yeah. so crazy that, uh, you know, like, uh, that makes me to remember something. Mm. I, I'm not trying to cut you off, baby. No, go ahead. Uh, you know how you hit somebody? with passion, but you, you still ruling for the person, but you hurt the person so much mm -hmm. that you cannot just wait the person to fall. Yeah. So you come out, oh, no, I wasn't even following you. I was just uh, waiting for you to fall. Yeah. You know, we saw a lot of that, Woo. you know, a lot of that. And uh, even let's make it very clear before we even saw that, God has already revealed that a time like this is still going to come. We mm -hmm. still have to be very strong. Yes. Okay? Because uh, a lot of people that you, like when you see them, when we are live streaming and you see them typing, I love you, I love you. And uh, sometimes when we see some people like that, we'll be laughing in our mind. Yes. You know, because uh, we already know, you know, mm -hmm. some people like how, Jesus Christ already know that uh, Judas will betray him or yes. will sell him. So, uh, you know, God be showing stuff. And uh, that's the most reason why we are encouraged. Right. We are You encouraged. know, when we see those fires coming, bombing, coming. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they be, I think they be slapping us across oh the God. face <laughs> with their comments. Oh it's so God. funny. And then... And then one lady, she really had the nerve to say that on our comment section, like, we don't got time to read it. Okay, so I'm just like, sweetie, you got blocked. You got blocked, okay? And we love things like that so yeah. we can block. Right Come on, away. We, got, we got block ministry over yes. here. Okay, so you got blocked. And uh, glory to God for that. <laughs> you just got exposed. Yeah. Because um, we know we got haters following us as, as well. And sometimes they just can't help themselves but to comment. And uh, then that, that anointed finger just go blah. blah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so oh uh, it's, it was, it's funny. And yeah. uh, I was so disappointed as well because um, our son, he's 16 years old. He was bold enough to share the dream. And we have not even told him the hate comments that he has received. Um, not really necessarily like speaking against him, but speaking against his dream. Mm -hmm. You know, we didn't tell him because that will, he, I, he, we don't want him, him to lose his confidence in his dreams. One thing about our son, his dreams come to pass. A lot of them. Yes. That we have put up here, you yeah. have witnessed it. Yes. You have witnessed it. it. Yes, you have witnessed a lot of his dreams. You know, and uh, the, the, the crazy part that uh, when, when people like uh, Judas is following you, they're not going to be listening to what you are saying. They will be listening to their own mindset. Yes. With the creative of their evil mind, the outcome of it is what they want to take out there. Mm -hmm. You know, and we made it very clear. 
Let's pray. Oh, we pray that this come to pass. That's the thing that people don't, they want to, li- they have selective hearing. I'm like, what? Listen to the dream. Okay? And then you notice at the end, my husband did not give an interpretation to the meaning of that dream. He said, let's pray that this come to pass. Let's I pray. I was yes. like, I pray this come to pass. Yes. Um, people just, <laughs> they need, ran with it. Need Jesus. Not, not only that, but we did a Luther Vandross um, video and, yes. and people said that I said he was alive. That is a dream. And Henry did do the interpretation of that dream. And he said clearly he hit, uh, Luther, Luther Vandross is really dead. I mean, I'm putting it in my own words, but he said he's not, he's not living. It's God is God used he God used examples for a dream, yeah. and people are taking it literally, like they taking my dream literally, literally. And I don't blame them because God allowed our dreams to come to pass in His ministry. But you need to people need to listen to the interpretation. That's the most important part of the dream, everyone. The interpretation. Okay. So sometimes, yeah, sometimes dreams can be. Um, straightforward. straightforward but on these type of dreams that we're talking about now you have to uh, really listen to the interpretation and don't uh, don't don't run with it and, and, and another thing people are also they just look at the title they don't look at the video and then they look at the beginning of the video but they don't they don't watch it to the end it's crazy it's crazy because you were saying something that made a lot of sense you said uh in the book of Daniel. Yes. You know, when Daniel was explaining the dream, he, in the dream, he didn't even see the king. Yeah. But he was, he, you know, it was all about the, the picture, the things, mm-hmm. the, the parable that God was bringing out from the dream. Yes. That he was uh, interpreting. Yes. You know, so I believe I was going to be like, but. He, why would he make up that? He, he, he didn't see the king. It was, it was, it, it was this. It was that. Why would he put the king on it? That, yeah. Like, come on. Because King people. Nebuchadnezzar had a dream, and nobody understood the meaning. Even the the sorcerers didn't understand the meaning to the dream. You know it. And when Daniel gave the interpretation. It was way completely off yeah. of the meaning, you know. Um, like my husband said, King Nebuchadnezzar wasn't even in the dream, but God revealed him the interpretation. And Who I just wish people will understand that. Yeah. My I m- majority of the time I will have a dream, and he, God, God will give my husband the the meaning to the dream. So if you're gonna listen to my dream, also listen to the interpretation. And sometimes my husband will say in some videos, it is what it is. You know, interpretation is not needed. Okay. So everybody, please, when you watch our videos, take your time. Please don't have selective hearing. And that's all I can say. Amen. Amen. Okay. (laughs) Look, I told, I've been telling, I've been complaining. Y'all better be glad that we went to Tennessee. Cause I was very mad. <laughs> so this this video, if you think I we were being harsh, believe me, this is nothing compared to what I really wanted to do. <laughs> yeah. I've calmed down because yeah. I'm disappointed in in some people. You know, really and, disappointed. And it's so cool because uh, people has been even even from all that that lady uh, the Naya. email the email. Oh yes. That lady uh, lady emailed about her daughter's daughter. dream confi- uh, concerning the same dream. Yes. You know, and uh, we have gotten a lot of uh, confirmation mm-hmm. and uh, prophecy from the, from the Lord concerning keep doing what you are doing in this period. And the greatest encouragement, there is a one that came in this morning. Today is Sunday. I just finished preaching mm-hmm. with this um, T-shirt. I don't know where we're posting this video. So anytime you see it, you know, it, you see God was still saying the same thing. And we, you know, God encourages us all the time. And people, yeah, some know. people, some great people out there also encourage us. And we appreciate that. Yeah, we do appreciate yeah. those comments, those lovely comments, those encouraging comments. And even people are trying to figure it try to figure it out like for us about the Naya Rivera um, dream. They were trying to figure it out and 
and, and stuff like that. And uh, it, we, we, we laughed about it and we were just like, oh, they just love us so much. They're just trying to figure it out. And, um, but I tell you, I was complaining. I'm like, oh my goodness, babe, this is the most hardest ministry that we have gotten ourselves into. Yeah. And, uh, I still thank God for it. We're strong. We're not going to get weak. Mm -mm. Um, I might complain every now and then be like, oh my God, <laughs> is this what God wants us to do for real? God, this is what God wants us to do. Ooh. I do know that, but it do get a little um, hard because you can't make anyone happy. Oh. Um, so our focus is on, I've said it several times, is to make God happy, yeah. continue to make God happy. And uh, I mean, it's going to be some scary moments in this ministry, yes. especially, um, especially when it comes to uh, death of celebrities yeah. are or something like that and I was even saying to myself I don't think we should even do it again because people really are just taking everything so serious and I'm like do I have to keep warning people this is a dream because I know I did it with the Clark sisters I said this is a dream yeah, like we always gonna say that uh, and like do we I got think, I think we're gonna always like <laughs> this is a dream and this is a meeting oh, like yeah. Lord have mercy but um at the end of the day um, we're not giving up and we're moving forward and I, you know this is a unique ministry I think this is we're so unique yeah and people are not used to that's why they can't figure this they can't figure, figure us out. out yeah they can't figure us out and it's all good and but they, they will not figure us out until God reveal it to them absolutely then they will be like, so because we have gotten a lot of email so people will like okay now I get it Okay, now mm -hmm, I'm gonna, you mm -hmm, know. yeah, it is what it is. It is what it is. So, um, speaking up on the email the lady sent us, um, we want to thank her so much. We hadn't had time to email you back. We want to, did we email her back? You didn't, did I you? Remember. I don't think we had time to email you back, but we want to thank you. Uh, we don't want to say your name because we didn't give you, we didn't ask for permission to put yeah. the dream up, but girl, yeah. you did encourage us. And I'm going to call you Miss Dee Dee. Miss Dee Dee, thank you. Okay, we appreciate it 100%. And if you have not seen her daughter's dream, please go to our community, community post. post because it's there. And that is a very, that's very important that you read it because in my vision I had, um, I had a vision about the whole thing. So I want you to please look at that. Yeah. So, and, uh, uh, mm -hmm. so let's keep praying. Mm -hmm. Keep praying that whatsoever that God has in this whole dream come to pass. Let the truth come out to light. Yes. That's what I, I'm going to say before my wife go into her vision. Well, I'm going to be honest with you. I wanted to be really petty. And I wanted to name this uh, video uh, Naya Riviera, comma, we apologize dot 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 right that's what i want to name this the title of this video mm -hmm. and then when the video came on i was going to say me and henry apologize for absolutely nothing <laughs> we're not apologizing for nothing we don't regret nothing we do mm -mm. we don't regret none of, the, none of the videos that we have done uh so so my pettiness is gone i've been delivered <laughs> amen so <laughs> well, that was the truth yeah the clickbait mm -hmm. and true. say we apologize but no we apologize for nothing uh we're gonna have another uh, title i'm gonna let my husband choose the title we might still do the title we might do it right we apologize yeah. for nothing <laughs> no we'll just say we apologize yes. dot 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 okay so if you see that title that's what we have chosen if you see something else we change our mind yeah. um but let me i'm gonna go let's go back into um my vision i had Okay, so this is the vision I had. Um, I seen Naya Riviera, and uh, I had seen her hair was kind of pulled back, and it was, you know, it wasn't fixed well because you know she's been through a lot. So I seen a, uh, they they taped her mouth up, they taped her mouth up, and they uh, she was tied to uh, the bottom of the chair, and she, and they pushed her down to sit her down and they tied her around the chair too so she was definitely in captivity 
and uh, I just seen one guy. It was just one guy. It wasn't a group of people. When there was just one guy, you know, like I said, he taped her mouth. He taped her up, and she looked just so frightened and afraid, and it scared the mess out of me because this is what she's going through. And so then I began to see the email that Miss Dee Dee sent us. And I seen the, the uh, in the vision, I seen it really quick. And I heard in the dream, she is right. She's right. And then the Lord began to show me the video that we made with our son about Naya Riviera. And then I heard the voice of the Lord say, he is right. He is right. And I woke up out of nowhere. And it's like I caught my breath when I woke up. And that was the end of the vision. And the whole thing, the period about this dream, where did this dream come from? That was a question that you're gonna be asking, everybody out there gonna be asking. The dream comes from God. Amen. So you can take this one and run, and run around. And run with it. Take it. Yeah. Comes from God. Uh, our prayers is still the same thing. Yeah. Let the darkness, let every darkness, let the light of God reveal the deepest darkness concerning this whole thing. Amen. All right. Yeah, and I want to make some something clear. I don't care what body they found. I don't care what the news is saying. I don't even care what they showed her parents. This young lady is still alive. And I know that we need to believe the media sometimes, but in this case, we don't need to believe the media. We need to believe the words of the Lord. So we have to continue praying that she will survive through this and that she will, this will allow the people to be exposed. Yeah. But don't give up on praying for her. I don't care what they're saying. And it was so funny. Uh, on July 5th, before all of this happened, that the Lord began to show me a dream and an example. Okay, if you want to watch that video, it's about the Luther Vandross uh, dream. Watch that video. And that's the reason why in the community feed I put N N Anaya uh, Riviera. Because in that dream, the Lord began to show me that Hollywood can, um, can fake a death or, or make a, was it, what, I, what, what was clone. it? Clone? Not, not clone. Well, we did talk about cloning. Um, no, they can make a person still look like they're living. Oh, yeah. You know? So I thought that was amazing. So I'm seeing here, they can make a person look like they're dead as well. Um, they they can manipulate us yeah. okay so keep praying and I know that our haters are going to be like it's supposed to be four months but we don't really know what four months mean yes we you are. know um, we pray that she will come back in four months so we pray I don't know if the Lord was saying in four weeks or four years we don't know what what really that mean it's a dream everyone but the whole thing is what the dream really is symbolizing is that she's still alive, y'all. Um, so let's keep praying and let's not give up on her yeah. and let the will of the Lord be done. Yeah. Until God says that she's dead, then we reveal. Yeah. God will definitely reveal. But our prayer will keep on being let her be found. Let her be found. Yeah. All right. All right. I guess that's all we got to say. Listen. If you're not subscribed to Henry and Monique, go ahead and do so. You know why? Because it will automatically make, make you cool a cool Christian. Because cool Christians. We hung out over, over here. here. God bless you all. We love you guys. Bye, y'all. Bye.